Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to this, and we're playing Skyrim again. Um, so, what we're going to be doing here, it's been a while since we've played Skyrim, so I thought I would keep you up to date here. I'm level 52, and I have updated fully. Uh, what's the one I did all the way? There's one I did here all the way, I can't remember. Um, but there is one that I did. Uh, I don't think I did any of them all the way, now that I think of it. Look at this, I haven't spent any points in all this magic shit. Uh, anyway, fuck it. Okay, so, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be doing some stealth and some stealing for the Thieves Guild, because if you don't know how to do it, there is an achievement. Let me go and get to it really quick. Uh, to restore... Where is it? It's here somewhere. Return the Thieves' Guild to its former glory. Now, I thought that you would get this once you've done the main quest. But if you don't know how to get it, this is how you get it. you got to go to the Brynjolf guy or whoever. Um, it's actually not him. It's the it's the Devon guy. And talk to him and get some quests. And you've got to do a lot of these quests, man. Like, I think you've got to do a 40 all up, which sucks because they're all the same fucking thing. It's either go to this building and change the numbers on the book. It's go here and pickpocket this person. Or it's go to this town and steal a thousand gold worth of items and then you got to do other quests for this other woman that's like go to this house and steal something plant something in this house and there's two other ones i can't remember so the best bet is to start two of them and go do two of them and come back and do another two come back do another two come back do another two come back so that's what we're going to be doing now uh so we'll start these we'll do the fishing job first and we've got to go to Whiterun for that. So Skyrim is an awesome game. Um, I've put fucking probably like six, 60 hours into it now. And I only just joined the... the You know, hey, you're supposed to join... What's the word? You can join the Stormcloaks or the other people. Oh, it's stuff here. I will join the Imperial Army or the Legion or the whatever the hell. And uh, that'll be awesome. I'd have no interest in helping these Nordish people. Fuck them. They're rude. So, I joined the Imperial Army. So, let's go and steal this bitch's shit. And we can get out of here and go do something else. So, we go into sneak. And the phone is ringing, but I don't care. We're busy. We're too in-depth here. Fucking hell. Alright, so... We wait two hours, maybe they'll go to their house, and we can flog it. And I wish the phone would stop ringing, because it's annoying me. Alright, now there's no one around, is there? Yes, there is. Who is around? Okay, so... We save it here, because you have a percentage of how much you can... St how You have a percentage of success on what item you want to steal. So if we save it here, and we have a 50% chance, then by... Say we have a 90% chance to steal, and it's gone. Now normally if you have like a 48% chance or a 30% chance or whatever, then a lot of times they'll notice you and you won't get the item. Um, and then the whole turn will fucking, the whole place will turn against you. So we've also got to steal some other shit. Really? Fucking, you look like Hulk Hogan when he's 90 years old. Leave me the hell alone. Alright, so we've got to steal something from this other guy's house. So we'll go up there now and flog that while we're at it. Uh, right here we go. Officer. In your own time. Thank you. Even though I do have the perk that makes you unnoticeable when you pick locks, but I don't trust it. So I will wait it out. So this is how you do it anyway, and it's a pain in the ass. You've got to do it so much, and it's just the same thing over and over and over and over again. So there's what we've got to steal. There's no bitches here, is there? And we will take it. And I am going to make a bit of a mess here. I don't give a fuck. That's what you do, you don't mess with the Thieves Guild. Just don't do it. You don't do it. And fuck with the guild. Alright. Now we can go back to Riften, to the Thieves Guild, and just imagine doing this over and over and over and over and over and over and over 
and over and over again. And it gets really boring, especially because like people say, "Oh, the load times in Skyrim are very short." Pig's ass. The load, the loads in Skyrim are fucking long, and it's annoying. So at this point in time, I'm checking my emails. I don't give a motherfucker. Have I got any emails? Probably not. But this time I'm going to look anyway. Oh, the game started. Xbox Live Rewards. Your Xbox Live Rewards statement for January. You have earned 20 points. Brilliant. Which is bullshit, because I bought a shitload of crap. On uh, February only. Easy way to earn more points this month. Uh, fuck off. Don't care about it. I mean, why should I renew gold and get 5% extra? Like, that's not even worth it. Alright, so let's go and see these bitches. About my reward, and then we've got to go through another fucking load screen. Like, granted, like, I don't understand that Skyrim can preload a whole fucking dungeon that's 20 miles long with enemies and loot and shit, but when it comes to inside buildings, it just can't do it. It, it loads, like, three rooms, and then the other f two rooms that are connected to it all take fucking load. I don't get it. It's weird. Alright, let's talk to this dickhead. We'll come back to your Devlin. I will enjoy the gold, thank you. Yeah, we'll keep doing the burglary jobs because they're fucking easy. Otherwise we'll be here. Shut up! Otherwise we'll be here for days, come on. Yeah, uh, we'll do the fishing job because I'm going for that achievement. I normally just do the numbers job because all you got to do is fucking just go into a, a like a store and you know those those books on the counter that you can't interact with. That's what you have to change, and it's so criminally fucking easy, and it's just the same shit over. Which is which is you'll notice when you get around to the end of Skyrim. Or I shouldn't say the end, but when you've beaten the quest, like some of the side quests and the main quests, and you're looking for stuff to do, you'll notice how fucking repetitive it gets. And you have to do it for not only that achievement, but to get 100,000 gold. How much gold do I have, actually? How do I tell? Oh, it's at the bottom there. I have 18,000. God damn it. We'll get there. Alchemy labs can be used to combine ingredients into useful potions and deadly poisons. Come on. Alright. <sighs> Shit, a brick. Like, it, for instance, the whole world is loaded right now. Although, technically, a lot of it will preload when you're walking around. That's why you get texture pop in in Grand Theft Auto and Saints Row and games like that. Because they're so fucking big. But it's, I don't know, the loading is weird. Okay, so let's go. Oh, we all both got to go to Solitude again. Okay, that works. Solitude, if you don't know, is like the main, the main castle-y fucking emperor kingdom thing. I don't know how it works, but that's where we are anyway. God. Magicka is used to power spells. Fuck off. The High King of Skyrim taught... Uh, fuck, why can't they just use, like, Ulfric Stormcloak who used the ancient power of the Thum to nearly shout Thorg to pieces? Or Torg? I don't know how to pronounce these fucking names. Alright, what do we got to go and do in here? The Winking Skeever. For those who don't know, a Skeever is a rat-like creature in Skyrim. Kind of similar to rad roaches in um, Fallout, I reckon. Not as in the same kind of animal, but I mean the same kind of enemy. For those paying attention at home. Come on! Fucking load! Thank you. Okay, so we've got to flog something from this prick. Dun 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 bum bum ba dee bum 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 Alright Difficult and sometimes Peters Sorry bitch This is what I do Steal your shit I don't give a motherfucker I got a family to feed motherfucker Got my chillin' Dun 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 dun. Boom boom boom. Fuck's sake. All right. 
Where's this other? What else have I got? I got a steel something, don't I? God damn it. So I don't actually own a t house in this town yet. I seem to. God, you are fucking ugly. You are fucking ugly. Actually, no. No, 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 no. I can't use. I can, no. Can't do it. Can't. I just can't. In good conscience. Conscience. Let you live. Or you. Fuck off. You're a witness. Fuck you, bitch. Alright, now that we've killed her, we can now... Yeah, it's just the, just the little things. Just the little things. Oh, man. I think I'm gonna... After this, I'm gonna start playing Kingdoms of Amalur. Amalur. Reckoning. And that's another thing I don't... Why do first-time RPGs, for instance, the Kingdoms of Amalur is a new RPG? Same with Dragon Age. Why do they have to put Dragon Age Origins, and why the hell do they have to put Reckoning? Why do they need a subtitle? It's the first game in the series. It threw me off, especially with Dragon Age. I thought there was another Dragon Age, considering the first Dragon Age was called fucking Origins. Yeah, it makes sense to call the first one Origins, but it also makes sense to call like the second one or the third one Origins. Because the, you, the it hasn't been explained very well in the first one. Fuck. Alright. Anyway, back to stealing. Why have I got red people on the map? Interesting. Who is looking at me? Whoa! Slow down, holy shit. I'm a lock-picking legend. No bullshit. And then when you when you pick the lock, you get a, you get a wax key. That's like a perk you can unlock. Which I don't understand. Because you've picked the lock, you open it, and I don't understand. Unless some locks lock themselves after a while, I don't know. TBD. Okay, let's get this. Fucking hell. Looked like it was in the other room. Yay, another candlestick. Just what the Thieves Guild needs. Fucking hell. That's right, I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit! What of it? That's right. That's just what I do. Oh, you got your lettuce or your cabbage all nice in there. Well, it's fucking cooked now, bitch. Oh, and you think you're fancy? You fucking hell. Oh, what else can I throw in there? Oh, you think you're good? You got to. I can't even fucking pick it up. All right, fuck it. Get this over and done with. So this is, this is the boring parts of Skyrim, my friends. Go here, pick it up, come back. Go here, pick it up, come back. Go here, pick it up, come back. And granted, that's pretty much all Skyrim is. Go here and pick up this and bring it back. But at least in other quests, you go through shit and you kill stuff and you fuck shit up. You do all that other kind of good stuff. Just not cricket. Just not cricket. And we get to endure the fucking loading screen of death. And I have it installed to those who say, mm, fucking install the game, you fucking idiot. I have it installed, so eat a dick. You move more slowly with your weapon drawn. Bum bum ba bum bum bum. Come on. It's climbing in your windows. Is there, it would be much better if they just fucking let you fast travel inside important places, such as like the Thieves Guild, the Dark Brotherhood, the Imperial. If you could just spawn, if you could just quick travel into the building, it would be so much better. So that way we wouldn't have to fucking preload the whole world. What do you want? You yeah, fuck off, you bitch. I'm restoring the Thieves Guild, motherfucker. Now we've got to go to the Ragged Flagon. Ugh. Come on. Why 
washable, no run school glue. Number one, teacher's brand. Safe, non toxic. Fuck off, Elmas. Uh, come on. How long does it fucking take to fucking load, you fucking cunt? Come on! Holy shit! Oh my god. Hooray! Jesus Christ. Well, you done or what? I've completed it. And we'll just redo this. Anyway, this is the Thieves' Guild. Anyway, so I will leave you here. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not going to have a drink. It will end up making me rich. Thank you, fucking whatever your name is. So we've got to keep doing this over and over and over and over and over again. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen. I'm out. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Au revoir.